Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new logo design tutorial and today we'll make a mascot logo and uh, for the cricket match and let's start the tutorial. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. At first going to the file and going to the new options, taking an artboard which is uh, blank and giving the name cricket logo and hit the create button. You are getting artboard which is blank and here uh, eps file of the uh, cricket ball provide you the download link in the video description so keeping this one beside that and after that going to the polygon tool select once you'll get a small window and uh, here if you write down six you'll get the hexagon okay now changing the color of the hexagon into blue and making this one bigger by pressing shift and hold it and press the shift and hold this one and rotate this one into 90 degrees okay after that press a which is the direct selection tool from the keyboard and a little bit small like this select once and small that means round actually and select once and press the shift and select this one and making it round or like this like a shield actually so selecting this uh, circle that means the ball and pressing it into the upper side of this and making this one a little bit bigger yeah that's fine so this one is the main theme to make our logo actually now i'll write down over here and uh, do other steps making it a little bit smaller okay that's fine and here we'll make a curve like that so for that going to the ellipse tool making circle and giving the circle color different so here press ctrl or command y you are getting uh, the shape actually and when i'm just making this one into actually middle select this circle and the shield and making it middle of this and while making the upper side of this okay that's that's good and we'll cut it uh, those portion so selecting this circle and shield and going to the shape builders tools from here and press alter option button delete this that's good and we need only this actually this portion so cut it out so we should cut it out selecting these three that means the ball shield and other stuffs and again going to the shape builders tool and cutting this and this yeah that's fine and we don't need this one deleting that this line we don't need that so we already cut it out so that's good okay only this one now our ball will bring it back into this and making it bigger yeah that's good we'll keep it uh, we'll use that that ball or that shield later so here i'm making another copy of this and then going to the rectangle tool drawing a little bit the rectangle like this okay that's good and now placing this one into this okay that's fine and another one press ctrl command d for the repetition yeah that's fine and making this one according to this yeah and then shift m shape builder tool and uh, removing those areas actually okay that's fine and deleting this one as well selecting all the stars making it group and now going to the gradient options selecting the gradient select the gradient color like this and actually we should keep white we should change this gradient into this and making this one 90 degree here is 90 degree yeah that's fine and now this one will place it into this into the downside yeah another downside and g from the keyboard 
selecting this G from the keyboard and making this one yeah blending it out we can make it a little bit smaller okay that's good and now we'll do the things the cricket match okay that's good and here actually we should make the ball size a little bit bigger yeah that is actual size that's fine now going to the text tool writing something like a cricket match or like that here taking another any kind of um, uh, font i'm using here this font and cricket and match okay making this one is smaller 1.6 times smaller okay this one uh, actually we should make it bigger and making the same font size and now 1.6 times smaller and again 1 times 6 times smaller okay that's good now i'll place it out over here making this into white color or we should keep this one into aside from the artboard because of this one is white okay going to the object and envelope is distort and make this one wrap here the value 16 or if i make in 17 i think 15 is good and all the stuffs zero and if i make it zero okay that's nice and hit okay after that going to a shape a drawing a rectangle and going to the object again and uh, going to the envelope distor and making this one same as the text and now going to the object and expand this one and hit okay giving the color like this okay and sending into the back side of this selecting these two things making it upper side now i'll change the color i'll changing the color like this yeah that's fine and the cricket these things okay making it a little bit bigger yeah that's good and now going to the object and expand this one and hit ok so controller command c copy this one and now i'll make it black and controller command a forward paste and i'll make it a little bit upper side of this here it will create a drop shadow which is long drop shadow that is that is we need to make it more uh, prominent or other stuff so making it into middle of this and making group and making this shield into actually this shield and this right up into middle yeah and now match the same thing will apply over here so going to the object envelope tester make this one same things same settings 15 percent here the arc lower and hit okay okay making this one into white color before that we have to make it object select this object and expand this one in it okay so ctrl c and ctrl f and now i'll make it white and sending into upper side so match that's fine and making it group okay after that here another rectangle like this and same color this color actually going to the object and here the envelope distort and make this one wrap and hit okay and sending into the back layer okay actually that is nice and making it middle of these two things yeah that's good and then we'll place it over here and sending and keeping this one into upper set 
okay now this layer going to the object and expand and hit ok and select this shape before that you have to ungroup that so ungroup these only that means this and this and this okay making it merge and now we'll change it out we can keep this one into this color or this color this color any kind of color something different okay i think the this is good now selecting all the stuffs and uh, copying this one all the stuffs and going to the object and expand this and hit ok so after that making it into one okay so here something actually we shouldn't use that okay this one we should make one and here is line we have to remove those line double press and isolate the things okay now making it like that okay that's good and now going to the object going to the path and offset path here 27 pixel and hit ok and making like this so the border should be like that we should have to match according to this the middle of the artboard actually not artboard middle of this yeah that's good now making it group and now going to the rectangle tool making here into the rectangle actually square shape making this one black or dark blue is good we are dark blue okay that's fine making it group and another copy making it bigger yeah rotate this one bring it into a front layer and make the opacity 10 like that and bring it into upper side and that is good actually we should make it black our logo is ready now you can do another thing uh, which is uh, ctrl c and ctrl f and making it clipping mask actually upper side of this and making this one clipping mask and this one into upper side so our logo is ready you are getting the nice logo and uh, which is really cool here you can uh, provide a drop shadow which will make the uh, separation from that going to the effects going to the styles and drop shadow and this drop shadow setting is like that 577.75 and hit ok so you're getting a logo which is for the cricket match so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section and in the next video i may see my signing out stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers bye bye